Right there. Reloading. There's no reason right now to be in your astral form. My guess is that your reasoning for this is because you want to use the abilities as soon as you can see your teammates essentially getting into this choke and taking the fight. But I think you need to get out of astral form and then just get with your teammates here. If you're a little bit too late, you can't be a part of the team fight. And I don't know why I keep doing it because I know that it's just as, as fast, if not faster, better for me to get out of astral form and be with them. Yeah, most of the time I'm trying to just get down the stars and get out of astral form and you know moving with my team on attack or rotating on defense defense or something like that as fast as I can. There are exceptions, obviously, like if you're putting down a lot of stars, if you need to get down stars quick and your teammates are about to like exec onto a site, okay, then maybe, yeah, you can use your utility while in natural form. If you're interested in free VOD reviews, check out my Discord in the description below. These will be done live on my stream every Friday. Just make sure to read the rules and requirements before submitting your VOD. All right, back to the video. Yeah, and the other thing is like, I think you've just like held on to your ult for like way too long. What you could do is you could tell your breach like, yo breach, I'll wall first. Once we take site control, play back of B and when they try to like retake, then pop your ult from B and just like destroy them this way. Or you can just like breach ult on the site and like do it that way. You don't have to use both ults at the same time, but you can maybe breach ult first, you know, smoke, get onto site, and then you can astral wall like this or something. If you guys are just taking like control of site so that they have to use you till the break through the wall and further delay it. And they do have an Astral Wall this round. So on a retake, use like a Astral Wall back site and block anyone off playing in Boathouse. So having a wall that can counter that so you can play outside of Boathouse, but still deny vision from these positions, that could be pretty good. Those are some things you can think about on a round like this. Close. And, uh... Yeah, this is the main issue, I think. You need to be ready to get your stars down a lot sooner than this. Listening to an enemy that's like running away somewhere and trying to like use a suck or concuss on them in like a random spot is just like, it's unrealistic. You don't even have smoke stars down yet and three of your teammates are already on site. Like right now I'm tucking behind this box to unswing the angle while my, my, my teammates fight. I'm getting stars down as soon as possible. And then once my team is ready to enter site, then I'm popping the smokes. So the timing is like, optimal so it's better to put a star in a position where it's like a common spot or if it's a cubby and you know that an enemy is there right i would just do the normal suck stairs smoke smoke maybe concuss here concuss close left you see what I mean by like having stars that are essentially your go-to stars? Like I think I put this in your notes before, but having those go-to stars, like if you just concussed here on dice or you concussed here on Jen, you would have hit that ISO. Like you see how Jed is dice and there was an ISO here who died. Trying to concuss someone who's like running away off a of site, like I said before, is like, it's really hard to do. Th these are like the three common spots I would use. Maybe this one for the gravity well. So this is the triangle of death here I would use. <laughs> so uh, standard five star default on this site typically smoke here smoke here like two stars and i would put a third star either here and you can watch nat's vods of him doing this but he puts a star inside the doorway at tree so that he can play inside of the smoke or peek out of the smoke and fight someone who is like walking up here so it's kind of like a little tricks trick smoke you can also recall this star and play inside of it and when it goes down you can kill someone here so there's a lot of ways that you can use like a, a nice little tree star here so you can either do like star here star here star here or what you can do is star a suck in front of it if you expect them to come a or maybe you have like a lack of util like in this round you know since you have a killjoy here you don't really have to have like a, a pre-placed gravity well star so you can star here with a suck in front of it because you only have like you and your reina here so you want to be able to activate this this grab well as soon as possible and not have to go into your astral form place the star as they're like rushing b you know what i mean you want to make sure this this star is like ready to go so i would do a grab wall star here uh star here and then you know if they need a star here at some point in the round you can do that this one way is pretty good even with astro star because it's like higher than a normal double stack so you actually do get a decent one way here you have a lot of like defensive strength here so you actually want them to play into this and fight your teammates so i wouldn't actually one way this but i would usually place like three or four defensive three round stars nice now, now you want to play your life here. You're by yourself. It's a 3v3. I'm, I'm waiting for my breach before I do anything else. They're planning. Yeah, this is good. Wait for your breach and now scale up a little bit. Spike 
Okay, this is a situation where I'd probably just ult back site and then maybe concuss behind uh, the boxes on site or concuss that like close left, you know, jump up position. But you probably want to put a smoke main. A lot of times like someone will stay main. So smoking main is really strong. And then I'd probably put like a, either a, a concuss here or a concuss here and just wall off back site. That's your win condition right here. That's what you need to do. Yep, smoke. No, do it. No. Okay, that smoke's fine too, but I think investing the wall here is just as good. Okay. Hurry, Jet. Nice. Okay, good recall. I actually like that. That was nice. Diffuse. Okay, you got it. Nice. Good job. They did actually end up playing out on site, uh, but just throw the wall down. It's not an amazing ult. It's a good ult, but like, there's no reason to save it. You know what I mean? Just use it. Okay. Okay, good job. Okay. Very nice, very nice. Thanks for the VOD, dude. That was a good one. And that's going to be it for this one. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like and let me know in the comments what you'd like to see from me in the future. Subscribe for more videos like this and check out this one next for more. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.